A lot of parents stock up on hand sanitizer before they send their kids off to school, but is it really worth it? Well, are you kidding? With an, as a new mom, my diaper bag is loaded with Full that of it, stuff. Right? Yeah. yeah. News Day's medical reporter Jocelyn Mementa live in the New Haven newsroom tonight with more on some new research now. Jocelyn? And Darren, the result may be surprising to some of us. It appears that hand sanitizer makes no difference in terms of how many times you get sick, and a proven method might be the way to go. A single squirt, is that really all it takes to keep kids from getting sick in school? Not so, according to a new study that says these alcohol-based gels are no protection against sick days. Researchers in New Zealand compared kids aged 5 to 11. All the children were educated in hand washing and hygiene, but half used hand sanitizers placed in their classrooms. In both groups, sick days were roughly the same over a five-month period. In short, having hand sanitizer in classrooms was no better than just teaching kids to wash their hands. Bottom line for parents, you might want to get back to the basics, teaching your child good hand washing and hygiene. It might mean fewer bottles of hand sanitizer and fewer sniffles. The findings of the study proves little benefit for hand sanitizers, but the study was limited. It was conducted during a flu epidemic, which means public health messages may have boosted hand washing among kids. But hand washing is always a good thing. Anne.